I'm Lisa Paribello, former assistant to Thurston County Commissioner Sandra Romero. The Earth Goddess has ordained me to rule over you lesser mortals. I am Thurston County Commissioner Sandra Romero. It's great to see you again, Sandra. Is everything okay? You look tired. I am tired, and things aren't going okay. Stop Thurston County is getting the best of us. They have infiltrated us completely. They have all of our records, and they keep finding out all sorts of classified information. They found out about the watershed characterization grant and YPA denied it. Karen and Kathy are hearing murmurs in the party that I can't win the next election. Ed Stanley says Karen and Kathy are the ones doing the murmuring. I need people I can trust. I need my Lisa back. I don't know, Sandra. I love my new job. We educate the youth on how and why they should be good environmental stewards. A lot of these kids would never see a place like this if Nature Bridge wasn't here to provide them. I'll double your salary. You can have a county car. You can have two. Yes, two cars. I'll give you two county jobs and double your salaries. And two cars. And an expense account. We'll just write two more sheriff's deputies out of the budget. Just tell me what you want, Lisa. You know what I want, Sandra. No, I don't. Yes, you do. Three jobs is my final offer. No, not three jobs. You know what I want, Sandra. I want you to accept Glenn Morgan's request for a debate at Evergreen State College and kick his ass for the cause. I want you to be my commissioner and finish this. I can't. Yes, you can. I can't. Why not? Because Stop Thurston County is right about the science on the pocket gopher. And about the sign ordinance. And the agritourism ordinance. And any day now they are going to expose us on the EPA grant and who knows what else next. And because Glenn Morgan is smarter than me. So what are you going to do then, Sandra? We're going through with the critical areas ordinance no matter what. We'll make a new sign ordinance and get rid of Stop Thurston County's signs. By the time the lawsuit gets to court their signs will be gone and the election will be over. Plus we have new changes to the public participation rules coming. We will price those peasants out of the market and we'll have no more peer-reviewed science from our local colleges offered at public hearings without paying the piper. Listen to yourself. You're going to charge people for putting information on the public record? This isn't progressive. It's not green. It's not liberal when you use the law to silence the opposition. If this is really about the earth why don't you just make a new critical areas ordinance that takes peer-reviewed science into account? Because protecting the earth isn't good enough. We have to control the earth or we will not save it. Until the day we can declare the Constitution dead and pledge allegiance to the United Nations, capitalist polluters, trailer park peasants, and tea baggers of all stripes will poison the earth with their snot-nosed children and the garbage that comes with them. All their swing sets and non-organic gardens. All their dogs and cats that don't get the good pet food from Whole Foods. All the gunpowder residue and heavy metals from their guns and religion. And I haven't even mentioned all the trucks and SUVs yet. It's too big a risk to take with the planet. I think you'll manage just fine without me, Sandra. I quit the county because I wanted to get away from the drama. I got sick of doing voter outreach to all the people you hurt. I got sick of making excuses to Don Corrupt why you're never at work. I'm sick of Danielle Westbrook hectoring me because I made a few more bucks than her, and wondering if Cliff Moore ever tells the truth. I had to get back to my environmentalist roots. A few more months at the county, and I would be joining the Freedom Foundation. Are you really going to leave me high and dry? When you started using the environmental movement to push your own agenda, you left all of us high and dry.